What's up, YouTube? Today, I review on the YJ Yuchuang V2M from YJ. I got this cube on the cubicle.com for $13, which is a fair price for a normal 5x5, but a really good price for a magnetic 5x5. The stock shades are the normal Moyuchi shades, and it only comes in stickerless plastic. The item weighs about 144 grams and is 62 millimeters on each side. The turning on the 505 is really fat. It's really crunchy and it's really smooth. And the inner layers, it's the same turning feel. Corner cutting on this 5x5 is pretty good. So, corner cutting here, really good. You can go a little more with some effort. And the inner layers, right here, with lockups. Oh, yeah. Here. Yeah. Corner cut a little bit, but you will get nasty lockups. And for the reverse, yeah, kind of good due to the flooring holes. Due to the magnets in this 5x5, the stability is really good. I don't get any flimsiness during a solve, and it doesn't jiggle a lot. Just for comparison, here is a non magnetic 5x5 Yushin Cloud. As you can see, due to the lack of magnets, it's kind of jiggly, and whenever I'm turning, it does catch and lock up a lot, and it feels like it's going to pop due to the flimsiness. Now, what are some issues with this 5x5? Well, it does catch a lot if you're not accurate with the turning. Lockups and pops do happen, but are pretty rare. If you are not really accurate with the turning, you can get catches. Like this. And if you like uh, do too many wide turns, you can get a lock up like this. Nasty one. Uh. And uh, it can pop, but that is extremely rare. Since this 5.5 has an anti-popping mechanism, it's hard to take a piece out. Let's try to take one out. There we go. So this is what the... Uh, one of the centerpieces look like. I'll show you another one. There. Here is another piece. And this is what the edges look like. And the corners. Oh. So it looks like the little magic mechanism, but it's by YJ. Now, do I recommend this 5x5? Yes. It has really good turning. Nice corner cutting. Even the inner layers. Despite the nasty lockups. And it has really good stability. And it rarely pops. It rarely locks up. But it does have a slight catching problem. But that is only if you're not happy with the turning. If you're not willing to spend a lot of money on a 5 5 a magnetic 5 5 then get this. This is basically a magnetic outwang, but cheaper and less professional. And it has these ridges here. So yeah, definitely get this cube. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!